Download and open Zoom, and then you can create a meeting or join by link, and that doesn't require logging in. If you're logged in, you can look at meetings to see if you've been invited to any. Here's period two, so I'm going to join this one. Bottom left are annotation tools, so I can annotate or highlight a picture or a graph or a math problem or even a reading, and then screenshot that to turn it in. It's like a handout right on the screen. So in the right corner, upper, you can raise your hand. You can click chat to talk to people in your group. There's a cool feature called breakout rooms if the teachers activated that under their room settings which you'll see in the corner what that looks like. So a breakout room allows Zoom to randomly or for a teacher to assign you to a small group to study inside the Zoom. Next, let's talk about e-etiquette. So remember that if you are in a noisy setting, try to always use the mute button so that you don't interrupt the room um, by having background noise. So final feature here, let's look at how you share your screen. So you can share quite a different few options, files from Google Drive, photos from your camera roll. And that's it.